All right. Uh, thank you all guys all for coming. It's a very special, very important day here. Um, we get to introduce three great, new, very qualified coaches to this athletic department. Uh, we're very excited to introduce all three of these guys to former student athletes and another from the region. So um, I know you didn't come here to hear me speak. So without further ado, we'll start with an opening statement from Director of Athletics, Kelly Wells. It, it is an exciting day here at U Pike. We're always excited about our athletics programs, but I think today's got a little bit level, a little higher level of excitement for us with some new coaches. We are blessed to have great coaches here, and I've always said, as an athletic director, your job's very easy if your coaches are very good. So we have very good coaches, and we're going to add to that great group of coaches here today. And uh, certainly, I'm excited about their potential. Uh, I know our student athletes. We have some of those here today. We've got you in good hands. So we're we're very blessed uh, that we've got great people and. Kennedy agrees that we're in good hands today, so we're excited. Uh, we'll kind of do this in, in a kind of an organized way. We'll, we'll go with our tennis coaches first, then we'll do our baseball coach, and we'll ask for questions afterwards. Uh, we'll have some photo opportunities in between, and uh, it'll, it'll all be great. So feel free to have questions, store those up, and we'll do those towards the end. I know some of the media will want to pull aside the coaches, and that's great, and we'll do that uh, at that time. So with no further ado, uh, first coach that I want to introduce to you is a uh, uh, a young man that we've had an opportunity to have here at school for, for some time, and uh, Juan Reyes, come on up, Juan, has been uh, an amazing piece of our campus, not just now because he's one of our coaches, but he does a little bit of everything on campus. He works in the cafeteria. He works with our tennis program. Uh, there's nothing that Juan probably hasn't done on our campus, so we're thankful from the student service side all the way to the athletic side of all the great things. Just a little history about Juan. He is from uh, Cali, Columbia. Uh, when he was player in 2012, he was the number one ranked 18 in U uh, player, so he brings great knowledge of tennis and how to play tennis, which was very important uh, in the role of, of coach. He was a four-year athlete here at U-Pike. He's a business admin major, uh, so having another uh, graduate representing our school uh, is, is awesome for us, so we're thankful on that piece. Uh, he's also been an assistant coach here for two years, and uh, we're exciting to, excited to announce Juan Reyes as our new head men's tennis coach. We won't put you on the mic yet. We'll get you in just a minute. Juan was very nervous about having to speak, so we won't, we won't put him in, in that position. Uh, one of the things I really wanted to do in our tennis programs was uh, really balance the male-female ratio that we have on our athletic side of it. We've been able to do that with Miss Kaylee Markham. Come on up, Kaylee. Um, Kaylee is not only uh, an awesome graduate from U-Pike, she also is a graduate from our high, local high school here. Uh, she just got a job in the Gifted and Talented program with our Pike County or our Pike Pikeville Independent Schools. Uh, we're excited about that piece, uh, but we're also excited that she's going to be running our women's tennis program. And a little background on Kaylee, a little bit more. Uh, she was a four-time state tournament participant in the 15th region. Uh, that really got our tennis program at the high school going. She's a big piece of of developing that part. Uh, she was an NAI scholar athlete and all conference player. Those are pieces we want her to show our females, that they can be those pieces as well as a student athlete, which is very important to us. Uh, and now she's going to be a teacher at Pikeville High School and Pikeville Elementary School. So she brings a great balance for us as far as the athletic piece, but she also understands the student athlete experience too. So uh, we want to welcome Miss Kaylee Markham as our new women's uh, tennis coach. And we'll get her on the mic in just a second as well. Uh, and our third hire, we're also excited about. Um, you know, the baseball guys that are here today the, really know that the, the affection that I have for them at our school and uh, outside of my, my players on my team, they're probably as close of a group that I'm to as anybody. I uh, really root for them in a lot of ways. So uh, when Coach Pitt announced his resignation, uh, I had the very first call was to this man I'm going to introduce to you as well. And we had some great candidates. We had over 50 applications for the position. Uh, which is showing the great state that our baseball program is in. Uh, but certainly I feel like we can move that needle even better now. And uh, I agree, Kenny, you are right. Uh, with no further ado, I do want to introduce Casey Hamilton. Come on up, Casey. A, a little background on Casey. And, you know, his, his father, Jody, is a good, good friend of our family and a uh, baseball guru as, as they come. And Hall of Fame person who's won state championships, just a, a man as I grew up that I admired a lot. He is good friends with my father as well, and 
Uh, we've watched Casey grow, and uh, you know he's had a great playing career. He's moved into a great coaching career, and just a little bit about that, he's a native of, of Ashland, Kentucky, played at Boyd County, uh, just a tremendous player, moved on to play at Mississippi State, uh, finished his career up at Western Kentucky uh, as a great player. Um, you know, he's coached at these different places, Vero Beach High School, West Jesmond High School, Oney Central College, uh, Western Kentucky, uh, Owensboro Oilers, and most recently at Kentucky Wesleyan. And that's kind of the track I looked for, someone who had experiences at a lot of different levels. One is a player, uh, which was very important to me that the guys knew somebody had the credible credibility of a player, but he's also been around programs that he's changed the, the entire culture. Uh, he's an associate head coach at Kentucky Wesleyan. I don't know how much homework you do on baseball, but turning that program around to a successful program, the last stint that he's been there has really turned them over uh, to success. And, and a lot of that comes in recruiting. Uh, our business is based around recruiting. Uh, we can act like coaches, we know everything, but certainly uh, those players are the most important piece and he understands that experience. There wasn't a person we mentioned on our roster he didn't know very well and, and guys he has in line to, to bring in. So we're really excited about him. And Alex, I want you and Kennedy to come on up as well, please. But we're very excited not only to add a great coach, but a great family to our community. Uh, as you can kind of see, uh, Kennedy is very excited about being here. We've been able to spend some time together, and uh, we're really, really excited about the, the entire Hamilton family, uh, not just Casey, which we are very excited about, but his entire family coming up to support. So uh, welcome our new head baseball coach, Casey Hamilton. about number three you really like, so that's what we got. All right, we'll, we'll kind of work in a little bit reverse order. Um, I'll let Casey kind of kind of give his mission and, and the things that he plans to do with the program. And, and I'll tell you this, and I don't want to steal his thunder, when we had people come in for interviews, you know, as a person who's done some interviews before and who's very goal-oriented and kind of knows the direction that I want my program to go, he came in with a game plan uh, on paper. Uh, that knew exactly where he was headed. Uh, that really reaffirms to me that he's ready to take over his own program. He knows the direction he wants to head. Uh, and really, to be frank with you, I was disappointed in some of the other candidates that did not have those kind of things. So like his goal, his vision was something that nailed it home for me and reaffirmed that I, I kind of did have good eyes and knew exactly what I was looking for. And um, Casey's one of those people. I'm, I'm excited about his future here with us. Uh, first, I want to thank Coach Wells and his wife uh, when we came down, they were awesome. My wife had a great time changing dirty diapers and everything else with us. But uh, as Coach Wells said, you know, to be named head coach at the University of Pikeville in one of the best NAIA conferences for baseball in the country is a huge honor. Uh, can't wait to get started. We're going to start on the field. We're going to start recruiting. I'm starting tomorrow. Or actually, I'll start tonight as soon as I get my computer and everything taken care of. But, you know, as far as the team and everything else, I've known, I've known about Pikeville for a long time. Uh, actually, I actually talked to Coach Wells a long time ago about this job. I think I was 25 or something like that. Wasn't ready, even close. But uh, Johnny LeMaster, I used to come to his camp. I think Dad brought me to his camp and uh, had a blast doing it. Loved the area. Coach Gassman I got a call from. Uh, you know, hopefully we can get him back down here and hanging out. It's funny. I said, Coach, I go, you know, I used to call you and you used to call me for players and you never said you're at the University of Pikeville. You always said you're coaching Cape Cod League. I said, no. I said, I'm going to have mine as the University of Pikeville. But any questions or anything like that, I'll answer. I'm just excited, ready to go. Thank you. I know, I know our media folks want to pull each of you aside, so don't run off, but please, this is great to see all our faculty and staff here, and, and it really shows the family environment that we have here and we're trying to build, and I'm uh, very proud of the culture we have, not only in athletics, but our entire school. We've got growl going on today. There's just so much good stuff, positive uh, vibes are going, and our culture is going to move in the right direction, and I think we're moving that way with all our sports, uh, and we're thankful for all of you. Our new Pikey, make sure that you check him out. He has leaned out. He's gotten taller over the summer. Uh, and he's going to do a great job with us. Pikey is a big piece of what we do. Our national champion uh, mascots, so we're, we're excited about him and, and the, new, uh, the new, new prospects he brings to the table. So feel free to make sure you say hello to the families, to the coaches, and I know the media wants to catch you. But uh, for no further question, we appreciate uh, all your time and our, our neat news today. Thank you.